RBI has once again raised its policy repo rate by 50 basis point in lieu of sustained and broad-based inflation. Although the domestic inflation has moderated, but there are clear threats to inflation trajectory at the global front. So it, it's extremely crucial to prevent the second round effects of inflation and at the same time uh, prevent the transmission of global inflation into the cost price pressures. Also, at the growth front, high-frequency macroeconomic indicators, especially for the urban demand, have shown a positive trend. There is a mixed bag as far as the rural demand is concerned. Credit of take, investment, capacity utilization, all of them are in positive zone. But at the same time, the resilience of economic growth needs to be ensured. Uh, as far as the uh, our external financial markets are concerned, th this hawkish stance, uh, will be extremely beneficial as the global central banks all across are lifting their interest rates and uh, this is extremely crucial to prevent the further uh, 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 fall of a, a rupee vis-a-vis uh, -vis the dollar and at the same time uh, uh, see depreciating currency also hurts our uh, manufacturing sector our producers so in order to ensure uh, that the uh, that important inflation does not hurt our manufacturing and our uh, supply side. At, at the liquidity front, uh, the credit offtake is already in its double digits uh, with uh, uh, non-food bank credit increasing specifically in the um, the demand for non-food bank credit increasing specifically in the corporate and retail sectors. Um, also, uh, the gap between the credit and the fund availability is likely to reduce further as we are expecting the increase in the term deposit rates by the banks. Um, and this would uh, sufficiently, uh, uh, this would satisfy the demand or uh, credit demand appetite of the se uh, different sectors in the economy. Also, RBI has committed to uh, continue using uh, or fine-tuning operations as far as to manage the liquidity through VRR and uh, different options. So, um, it is uh, this hawkish stance is extremely uh, is uh, important at this juncture since the global central banks are lifting their interest rates and uh, keeping in mind the falling uh, value uh, of uh, rupee so it will provide an uh, cushion as an external buffer to India further if we are able to attract more, more foreign inflows, foreign fund inflows as we have seen in the recent past.